everybody, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we're Belisa. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. It's a Disney day and it is the most perfect weather. It's cooler, but it's not too cool. There's a nice breeze. It's really crowded here today, but that doesn't stop us from having fun. Let's go. He welcomes Mickey Mouse and some of his best pals together with the Disneyland Band as we proudly present the Mickey and Friends Fantastic Cavalcade. ones are seven through ten. Okay. Kind of have the symbols memorized? Pretty well. Okay. So one through six is easy. Yeah. So seven through ten is a little more difficult. Okay. 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 Do we get to refer the, back to that if we need to? Yes. Okay, and okay. these are what the winning hands look like. Okay. The base winning hand you kind of want to just go for is Sabak, which is uh, zero with a pair. Zero with a pair. Yep. Okay. That's like the base hand you kind of want to go for. There's better hands than that. But on the first game, you kind of just want to go for that individual pair because it's kind of simpler. Okay. Are you playing as well? Yeah. Um, I think he might want to. I don't know. Okay, well, if, I'll... Like, if you so play for him, yeah. Yeah. then, like, because uh, it's math and numbers and stuff. It's a little... Oh, oh he's a savant. You don't yeah, know. he's really a genius. Yeah. Can I look? Yeah, go ahead. 
Yeah, we're gonna look. It's you like playing play poker, it. honey. Well, Did you get it? It's like kind of like playing poker. Yeah. I'm gonna bluff my way right through this. You watch. Oh, I just told. So we're gonna play a game where all of our cards are face up, so I can give you tips and instructions on what I would do. Okay. Oh wow. Okay, you got a pocket pair yeah. of zero on the first hand. That's not bad. Good job. So on your turn, on round one, what I would do is just draw and see what happens. Hope for that eight or a one. Okay, you got a six, that's not awful. Okay. Good. So you just put it in your hand and that is your turn. Okay. What you're gonna do is, because you already have zero, what you're gonna do is you would draw and hope to get one of the zero cards to get a yee-haw. Because there are two zeros and add that to your hand it just makes your hand that much better. Yeah. Okay. So I would draw and see what happens. Just put it down. You just got a yee-haw, wow. Yee-haw! Yeah. That's called a yee-haw. Okay. Um, there's only three hands in the game that beat that. Okay. Wow. So. You ain't getting it. No, I well, don't there's only so. one. Other, well, there's only one other um, zero in the game, so. Okay. okay. So it's now your turn, guys. Um, what I would do is discard the 10 and draw. Uh, the, the weird looking one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. And then you want to hope for a two. You got a three. A three is not bad. You're still one. And I'm going to discard the seven and hope for a five. Okay, I got a one. Okay, that was one round of the game. Okay. Now we're done with okay. one round. There's three rounds in the game. Okay. Okay. So now I'm going to draw. Well, you can either discard and draw, just draw, or draw from the discard and swap. I'm just going to draw. You're just going to draw. Don't want to discard? Nope. Okay. That did not... Actually, that did help you, because in the next round you can discard the eight and be at zero. Yes. You stand and do nothing. I'm doing great. Okay. Yep. I stand. Draw. You need oh. to get to zero. You're at one. So you could either. Stay? So that's a ten. You could, but you're not at zero, so I wouldn't. Yeah, you need a draw. Unless you are at zero, you don't stay. Oh. Um, so no, either you could draw. discard the two, or the three and draw, or you could just draw and see what happens. I would just draw. Okay. No, I would discard to hope the match one of the other ones and go for zero. But what if what's right here is a three or a two? Oh yeah, that's true too. Oh, that's true. All right. Because that's so the discard. Yeah. That's the risk. You have twice the thing. Draw. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That did not help you. <laughs> so they would have if you'd have kept that one. Yeah, he's gonna discard and draw. And that did not help me at all. So I'm discarding this. Yep. And you stay? Yeah. And I do I have to draw? Nope, you're done. No. Okay, good. You're gonna stay. Yeah. And you would discard the red card. Discard the seven. No, discard the seven and stay. Discard the seven and stay. Okay. Because okay. this is third and final round. The third odds, and final round. The odds that she gets another negative one is really rare. Okay. But I'm at eleven. I have to risk it. And I got something pretty good for me. That's good. Okay, I'm gonna stay, right? Yeah. I have zero. Well, that was my. That was the was game. The third and final round. Oh, got it. So our winners go you, then you, and then me, and then you guys. Uh, Yay! You guys did pretty good. Thank you very much. Wonderful. Good job, honey. You got first place. Fun game. Thank you for teaching us. Yes, this game is actually for sale in the market. Oh, okay. Um, okay. It's $16.99 in the market. Okay. It's a lot of fun to play. I agree. And the more you play, the other strategies you kind of learn to kind of risk and how you gamble. Now, Thank you. what, um...
video here. Again, I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill, and together we're Belisa. Thanks so much for watching. We had so much fun. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!